Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you are sleeping. The deepest and darkest depths of oceans are filled with ghoulish and nightmarish creatures that will shock you with their unimaginable features, horrifying and odd characteristics that have stumped even the experts. Blobfish. Meet the world's ugliest animal. No, I am not the one saying it. It's voted by the public as the ugliest one. The fish's body is flabby and blobby and is not accustomed to being out of the water. The haphazard appearance is due to the fact that it doesn't have any bones or much muscle mass. But being ugly has its perks. The fish holds well in the high water pressure. Their intensity to withhold pressure and retain a perfect shape has baffled scientists. Under 4,000 feet below, that extreme pressure would crush our organs and turn us into a sort of paste. Meanwhile, the blobfish would look just like, well, a fish. Yeah, it's not that ugly there, people. Bloody Belly Comb Jelly Now, this one is interesting. Do you know that the Bloody Belly Comb Jelly defecates sparkles? I mean, what? This creature is seriously a sight to behold. It is a cone jellyfish that has a sparkling display on the outside, which can be seen by the refraction and defraction of tiny hair-like cecilia. It also has a ruby-colored stomach which gives the body a red hue. This helps these creatures to stay near invisible in the ocean depths to avoid predators. This is because deep in the ocean where light can't penetrate, reds appear black and so seamlessly blend into the dark waters. But then again, when they defecate, the glitters make them vulnerable. Jawfish. The deep sea creatures have their own unique ways of life. This fish cares so much about its family that the males carry the eggs in their mouths until they hatch. True to their name, the jawfish not only use their prominent jaws to incubate eggs, but they also use them to move rocks. These mouth brooders are lovingly known as Mr. Moms by the sea explorers and divers because of the affectionate roll reversal. The male jawfish opens its mouth every other minute to rotate the eggs, ensuring clean and oxygenated water for the eggs. Red Handfish We know fishes swim, but have you ever seen a fish that can walk and has got hands? This is a red handfish and they can walk on the seafloor with their modified fins that resemble human hands. They are native to the reef in southeastern Tasmania. Previously, it was thought that only one red handfish colony existed that consisted of just 100 adults, but recently, another colony has been discovered that has given marine biologists a better chance to study them. That's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video till the end. See you next time. Gulper Eel We all know what the traditional eel looks like with its slender-shaped body, but Gulper Eel is an upgrade in the eel clan. Let's say that it is a loud mouth. I mean to say that it literally has a huge inflatable mouth. This enormous eel has a mouth that is much larger than its body. The mouth is loosely hinged and can be opened wide enough to swallow an animal much larger than itself. Scientists are baffled by this adaptation, but according to them, this is an evolutionary trait that appeared due to the difficulty in finding food. Yeah, they literally went and gave themselves a bigger mouth to eat bigger prey. Feather Star Is this a plant or an animal? This marine invertebrate is known as the living fossil of the ocean. They are proof that beauty gets better with age. They have enormous feather-like arms that radiate from the central body. Interestingly, this is also their feeding mechanism. They feast on sponges, corals, or other substrata by trapping them in the sticky arm grooves. Feather stars have the ability to shed their arms the way some lizards shed their tails. Some feather stars are also toxic, helping them avoid getting eaten. Chambered Nautilus most creatures baffle scientists by the extent of their evolution, but this one is totally opposite. Scientists are shocked at how it didn't evolve an inch since 480 million years cruising deep ocean reefs, even before the time of the dinosaurs. 
Is it safe to say that they have seen everything, keeping in mind that they are pure grandpas? Why grandpa? Well, because it can't see anything, clearly. Just a little blurry image. Compared it to other sea creatures like the giant squid have highly developed eyeballs, which it was gifted by evolution. Ribbon eel. Okay, so this is a ribbon eel. Yeah, yeah, it's extremely colorful, cool and bizarre for an eel. But what really sets it apart from all the other marine creatures out there is their ability to transition. Just know that all the ribbon eels on this planet are born male. They have this bizarre mode of reproduction in which the eel undergoes an extreme gender transition. After hatching from their eggs, ribbon eels have a black velvety hue, which helps divers identify that it is a juvenile. As they age, the color changes into blue and yellow, which denotes that it is male. After getting older and seeing everything in the world, they start to develop female reproductive organs. Eventually, they become entirely female, which allows them to start laying eggs. Crossoda norvagica jellyfish also known as the psychedelic medusa. This jellyfish is said to be one of the most colorful residents of the deep sea. This species is described as alien-like and is known for its vibrant red hue. They are quite small in size with some only reaching up to two centimeters. Unlike the other jellyfish in which you can't determine the male and female, the Crossoda norvagica jellyfish have distinct male and female morphology. The females have large and globular eggs under the umbrella-shaped jelly membrane, and the males, gonand, are shaped like sausages. Their offspring latch onto the mother's belly until they are ready to come out. Sarcastic Fringe Head The name is enough for the introduction. As its name suggests, the fish has quite a funny appearance, but more than its behavior is extremely funny and bizarre. The fish literally kisses during intense confrontations and arguments. When the two fringe heads are in territorial battle, they settle it by wrestling with each other. The wrestling consists of pressing their distended mouths against each other as if they were kissing. The fish with the bigger mouth wins and establishes dominance. This competitiveness accelerates during the mating season. They do these elaborate shows to get the attention of females who choose the most appealing mate and lay their eggs in the male's burrow. Yeti Crab If a yeti and a crab had an offspring, it would have been this crustacean. This one has been discovered by a team of scientists not too long ago. The name comes from the hairy and bristly appearance resembling a legendary snow monster, Yeti. The animal lacks eye pigment and is thought to be blind. What perplexed scientists about them was their place of discovery. They were found along the Pacific Antarctic Ridge, south of Easter Island, at a depth of 2,200 meters, living on hydrothermal vents. As the cold seeps into the deep sea, the Yeti crabs chill out by making a colony near naturally occurring hydrothermal vents. Cockatoo Squid this creature looks like it is coming straight out of the dream world. This beautiful creature is known as a glass squid or a cockatoo squid. Its body is filled with ammonia solution to give it the shape of a balloon. This squid is translucent and can't easily be detected by its predators. They are three to four inches long and often contain bioluminescence, which helps them in blending with the water even further. Imagine what else could be hiding in the deep sea. And now, let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by a subscriber. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it to us. Who knows? We might even feature it in one of our videos. Today's subscriber pick is a picture of a black swallower, a creature from the underworld. Now, why did I say that? Well, firstly, the creature looks extremely ghoulish. And secondly, they have the ability to swallow more than they can chew. Actually, thanks to their balloon-stretched stomach, large mouth, and long lower jaw, they can swallow up the animal twice their length and 10 times their weight, and keep moving, living and breathing with that. Porcupine fish. Porcupine fish belong to the family of puffer fish. As suggested in the name, when they feel endangered, they puff up by swallowing water. 
And just like the porcupines on land, their spines come out, preventing them from being eaten. Some porcupine fish contain a toxin in their internal organs, which is 1,200 times stronger than cyanide. The little fishies sure know how to defend themselves, but to some predators, they are just the means to get high. Yeah, no kidding. The dolphins use them to have a good time. Thank you so much for watching the video till the end. See you next time.